Hello my paper crafting family, welcome to the Father's Day craft edition of Paper and Joy and this month we are making a set of coasters for you to enjoy a drink with your dad or a loved one. So let's go and see what's in your packs and get crafting. Okay so in your packs you will get two wooden coasters, um, two felt pads that we're going to stick under the coasters so you save your tables and that sort of stuff and they have a sticky top that we're going to stick on, uh, a brush to put our glue on top so that we can make it a little bit waterproof and also a um, piece of paper which we're going to use to decorate the coasters. All right. You will also need um, some glue. We're going to use both the uh, glue stick and also if you can grab your PVA glue uh, that you got a little while ago. Scissors, your nail file again from a couple of months ago, uh, pencil and I've wet a piece of paper towel like if you've got a baby wipe or wet face cloth or um, yeah paper towel is great because we're going to just for getting the glue off our fingers. Also rubbish bin and a piece of scrap paper. All right, let's get crafting. All right, the first thing we're gonna do is cut out our circles to go onto our coasters. So turn your paper around. Now these just fit, if you have a look, which is awesome. <laughs> so, um, yeah, they'll just fit on that, that square. So if you take your first one and put it, if you can, right up to the edge, and the mechanical pencil, like this really thin one, works great for that to get that nice uh, tight edge to that. Okay, and then another one in the other corner. And then you can cut them out. I'll see you when you're finished. Okay, so there are the two pieces of paper cut out into circles. Let's stick them onto our coasters. Okay, so grab your coasters, your papers, scrap paper for gluing and your glue stick. And let's get sticking. Starting from the inside and the middle and working away to the outside. So we've got most glue. All the wetter school on the outside so you don't have edges that roll up and then pop it on your coaster. <clears throat> I'll just turn that over to help that press and dry and do the second one. We'll be now filing the edges just to get those <clears throat> nice and smooth so don't worry too much if your cutting's slightly off. Okay, there we go. <clears throat> and now we can grab your felt pieces and just pop them on while that's turned over and drying. So they have like this sticky peel off, so peel that off any rubbish and then turn it over and stick it onto your coaster. And same with the second one. Okay, 
that sounds got a good surface to you know sit on your table and not make a mess or not scratch I should say um, okay so we're gonna do the top pieces now just give them um, the, the filing around the edge and pop some glue on the top just to put a little bit of a hopefully a bit of a waterproof coating so that you can give it a wipe um, all right so grab your nail file and we're just gonna again do like we did the other time I'm just gonna go down rather than up just to cut that paper off without wrecking the edge And then across a little bit, it's probably the best. Just work your way around. <coughs> Get a nice smooth finish. And I'll see you when you're done. So when you've done your filing, obviously it's a bit dusty, so grab your, your wet paper towel and just give everything <coughs> bit of a wipe and dust to get the, the excess bits off. Okay, that's where your scrap paper is good to catch all your, all your filings. All right, so let's go and glue our top. Okay, so I've just shaken off the um, filings into my rubbish bin. So grab your, your brush and your glue. I'm gonna have to take the lid off this. first okay okay and then right, I don't know if your brush fits in mm, maybe pour some glue oh, there we go okay so just yeah, it might be easy to no, my brush just fits in working away from the center to the outside again so we don't sort of lift that edge the paper just give you the paper a bit of a glue so not too much otherwise it will start to curl but just enough just to give it that bit of sealing for any wet dribbly drinks you may put on it's a nice light coat work your way around and then when you're finished with your brush, just make sure you wash that out so the glue doesn't stick and stay on it and you can use it again. Who knows when we might use it. There we go. Okay, so a nice coaster to have a drink with dad or a loved one. <clears throat> Hope you've enjoyed that craft. Repeat obviously for the your second coaster to put the glue on that one. And I will see you next time.